to all of you all on uh, the special occasion of carols being uh, hosted on the terrace so led by the young apostles so can we give a round of applause thank you so much for taking time and coming all the way so what i feel is uh, so each and every one were invited you know when uh, the shepherds were being informed by the angels to uh, about the birth of jesus you know i feel uh, when they were walking along then uh, about the kings when they were marching along and uh, we see the environment was you know this it was kind of dark and uh, a pleasant environment so i feel the carols on the terrace is an is is an apt to what has happened over there so the kind of experience that the angels the kind of experience of the shepherds that they had amongst you know in, in the cool breeze and uh, in the open in the environment like this so do you feel that do you have a different experience as to having the carols on the terrace or do you do you feel do you have that similar kind of experience which the shepherds might have had or the angels might have had in the open environment okay so let's begin with a small prayer thank you heavenly father thank you lord jesus thank you holy spirit of god for this precious moment for this precious day for this precious hour that we are here gathered over here lord to glorify you to praise you to worship you lord jesus today we welcome you into this place lord we welcome you into this place lord lord as your word says for two or three are gathered in your name there you are lord jesus here we are more than two or three lord and we have come over here to glorify your name to praise your name to worship you to accept you oh god as our lord and our savior yes god today may you come over here dwell in our hearts and make a difference in our lives lord we surrender this day the plan the schedule the singing yes lord may you be glorified and may the holy spirit of god renew our mind may the holy spirit of god renew our mindset renew our heart may you take birth in our lives lord lord jesus we welcome you into our heart we welcome welcome you into our lives please come and may the holy spirit of god ignite that love within us may the holy spirit of god pour out the love of the father the love the representation of love you were oh god for your people for your children may that similar love be poured into our hearts today may our hearts burn in love for you lord with the love that you have come oh god leaving all of your glory leaving all of your fame lord to save our lives taking 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 the form of a human lord may we realize this day how precious oh god is your love for me for us lord lord jesus may we go out of this place renewed with your love renewed in relationship with you renewed in the understanding of god that we have for you we seek the intercession of mother mary we seek the intercession of all the holy angels and saints in jesus name we pray amen amen so now we have cheryl who would share with us as to what exactly the carol is all about let's hear from her shall we all welcome her with a round of applause please thank you seasonal greetings to all of you who have surrounded here so i would like to share few facts 
uh, about the carols in specific, only the carols. So during this uh, Christmas season, during this month, we hear this melodious, you know, singing of this, you know, carols, you know, choir usually sings. It is very melodious. Uh, Latin is a very difficult language to understand. It is not so easy. Not everybody can understand Latin. Even the people who were living in uh, Rome. So it was so boring, so much so, that people started losing the interest in celebrating Christmas you know, during the 12th century. Coming to 13th century, St. Francis of Assisi, you know, he was the first person who translated these Christmas carols into different languages, that is, native languages, where uh, even local people could connect to carols. Earlier it was in uh, Latin because of which nobody could understand what it actually meant. But when St. Francis of Assisi, he usually played or he usually uh, sung this Christmas carols during the nativity plays. So when you sing these carols during the na nativity plays, in between the nativity plays, uh, it becomes more meaningful, right? So you see an act, then he used to sing it. So after that, um, if you see, uh, the word, you know, carol is usually derived from the word, uh, French word, which is called as carol, and the Latin word, which is called as carol. Uh, in, uh, you know, usually it became a very popular thing back then. There was no concept of Christmas as such thousands of years ago, but uh, th they were pagans who used to sing carols uh, four seasons you know they used to sing this uh, song in four seasons of the year so when this um, they used to sing uh, the literal meaning of carol is nothing but dancing in circles christians uh, took over this pagan um, culture which is uh, mostly called as winter solstice uh, celebrations it is called as winter solstice celebrations they usually uh, the christians came up they took up this culture and they uh, started singing carols they converted the pagan songs into carol songs praise the lord praise the lord, lord. now we are so privileged that no one is going to persecute us for singing carols today so before we begin the carols uh, i just request you all you know we have handed over the sheets with you so as we sing along i request you all to please follow the follow the sheets and sing along it is no it is not just us singing but it is all of us coming together and giving glory to god so all ready for some carols Yes? yes? Come on, I can't hear you. Look at our faces. Yes. We are so dry. You need some energy. Come on. Are you all ready for some carols? Yes. Oh, let's go then. That night. Oh, that glorious night. When the Savior was born. The shepherds watching, the cattle grazing, the stars brightly shining, so cold, so beautiful, and so mysterious. Oh, that night, that silent night, oh, that holy night.
that glorious night, in that silent night, all of a sudden, the angel of the Lord from heaven appeared on earth, rejoicing and singing, Oh, born as a king of Israel, adoring the only Son of God with songs of exaltation. Was a sin.
And that night, when the shepherds were watching over their flocks, an angel of the Lord appeared to them, telling the good news, the good news that a Savior is born. Oh, those lowly souls were so filled with joy that a Savior is born. And they spread this joyous news with songs all over the mountains.